Hello viewers and welcome to a not very happy update video. As some of you will know, if you're on my stream last weekend, um, or just, you know, general videos, I've mentioned it a few times, I've been having some problems with my capture card lately, and then yesterday it came to it, and it's just pretty much broken. Um, the PC will not recognize the device anymore, or, or you, when I load up the software it will say, please connect the device, but the device is connected. Um, this is the same problem that Hoodlum Scrafty ended up having, which kind of sucks. So, um, yeah, this thing, it still works as an actual DS, so I can still play games on it and stuff like that. Um, but I can't use it to record videos. Fortunately, as some of you will know, I have a second capture card, so that's good. However, the second capture card is this, which is only a normal 3DS. Um, and as all of you will know, once you go from a 3DS to a 3DS XL, switching back to a 3DS with the smaller screens is just absolutely horrible. Um, plus, this capture card has an addition on the lower on the base here, which also sucks. So, uh, just going on to how this is going to affect the videos and everything like that. Um, the Y egg lock won't be affected because obviously I can use a second capture card to actually record it, even though. Um, you know, it'll be a small screen, so it'll be less enjoyable for me, but I'll still get you guys the content. Ranked Wi-Fi battles. They should still continue, however, they will have to be reset. The reason for that being is once I switch my game from my 3DS XL capture card to my 3DS capture card, the rating, like my wins-losses ratio, will be reset. So I'll have to start again, pretty much. But hopefully, that's not, that's not too bad, to be honest. Just means I get a reset. Um, and I think that's that's really all the uh, other X and Y content I do. I mean, stream-wise, I should be able to stream still. The problem with that is obviously because it's a different 3DS, you guys have to add a different 3DS code. For the Egglock training, I'll still be doing that on this 3DX XL. Um, see, the problem I have, or the two big problems I have, um, one of them is my main X and Y games are downloaded onto my SD card here. They're not on, they're not card versions. So it means, hopefully, I, I should just be able to take, take the SD card out put it in that one and just play the games there. Hopefully I can do that. If not, we're going to be in a lot of trouble because um, obviously it means I won't be able to battle very easily or record battle or yeah, record battles at all um, or you know, battle or stream very easily because all my stuff will be on the other 3DS, Egglock and the other stuff. Egglock should be fine, but don't worry. Um, but yeah, streams should still be able to happen, um, but obviously with different 3DS code and stuff like that. Um, and what else is there? There's other Wi-Fi battles. Basically, you won't be seeing any live Wi-Fi battles, pretty much, because I want I want thing the thing is, as I mentioned, switching from a normal 3DS or you know, 3DS XL to a normal 3DS rather is horrible. Um, for those of you who've got one of each, that's a 3DS there, and here is a 3DS XL here. Now, if you look at the screen difference, it's almost twice the size. You know. So, really, switching back to a normal 3DS after playing on the XL for so long is just really, it's not fun at all because the screens are tiny. Um, you guys get what I mean there. Um, so, hopefully, I can just switch the SD card between the games, you know, just play, play it myself on the XL and just whenever I need to record a Wi Fi battle or ranked Wi Fi battles, I can just put it on the capture card one and record like that. Um, and that's, yeah, that's pretty much it. I mean,. I really don't like this capture card to be honest, I mean, this extra edition here, the black bit, is not usually on a 3DS, you know, it's not usually there, usually you just get this top, obviously top screen and then this bit, but when I sent it off obviously to get it installed, they take the lower panel off and add, or at least Loopy, Loopy does, this is this is Loopy's capture card, uh, for those of you aren't, that aren't up to date on capture cards, there are basically two, there's Loopy's and then there's Katsukati's. Um, this is Katsukuti's here. I have messaged Katsukuti on Skype. Um, I've heard they do repairs. Sleepy Drarch on Twitter said they do, did repairs. So I, I messaged them. Um, so hopefully they reply. If they re get re if I get a response from them, then obviously I can send it off for repair. That would be really good. Um, but if they don't, obviously then I'm a bit stuck. So I tried almost everything here. Yeah, unplugging it, plugging it back in again. Just like cleaning the connectors and stuff like that. Um, uh, the only other thing I could possibly try is taking off the back panel and seeing if you know there's a loose connection in there. But I really don't want to do that because I could break the DS and that would be even worse. Um, so really, I have three options. One, I just carry on using this capture card that I don't like at all um, because of its size. 
uh, or two, buy a new capture card from Katsukati. This is if they don't do a repair or if they don't get a reply from them or whatever. Um, I mean, yeah, it's a risk buying another one from Katsukati. I mean, really, it could just be I got a faulty one, you know, that it wasn't put together exactly right. Um, I've heard, you know, Callum had problems, heard them scratch had some problems with that. The heated mill had, had problems too, and it's ordered, they now ordered one from Loopy, but I really, I don't like Loopy's capture card at all. The extra edition on the bottom is just terrible. Um, but, it is a risk, I mean, no one else has had any problems from what I've heard, it's just Callum and, um, Callum and the mill. So, um, I might risk it and buy another one, but that would be, you know, it's like $460 or £280, which is not cheap. Um, especially since I've only had this one since like October, November last year, which isn't that long ago to be honest. So, um, I mean, I'm strapped for cash at the moment as well. I, mean, I was going to buy a laptop soon so I could, you know, work on that, make videos on that, etc. Um, but if I have to go and buy another capture card, I'm not going to be able to do that. I mean,. I mean, some people are probably say, "Oh, you know, get your subscribers to donate or something like that." But I, re I, yeah, I really don't want to ask you guys for money. Um, it's really, uh, it's not vital for me to get a new capture card. I just really want one, <laughs> so I might end up buying a new one. I'll keep you guys up to date over videos. I just wanted to let you guys know about, you know, the change, um, and it might affect the videos slightly. It's just because I'm you have to get accustomed to switching 3DS games, etc. Um, but yeah, it really sucks that that happened. I'm holding a stylus for some reason. It just really sucks it's happened. Um, I'll probably end up buying another capture card and with free 3DS's, so that's fun. <laughs> um, but yeah, I just wanted to let, update you guys on the issue. Uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. I'll see you next time, guys. Thanks for watching. Goodbye, my friends.